The little boy runs out of a store bathroom, tells his father a grown man stood next to him and stared at his private parts. Moments later, that convicted child molester Mark Clapper tried to run from police, but he couldn't run far enough or fast enough to get away from his sordid past. Rich Jaffe is here with a Local 12 investigation revealing things you need to know about what Mark Clapper has done to other children, Rich. Rob, according to police, when Clapper was arrested this weekend, he told the arresting officer, I'm sorry. I was wrong. But in digging through Mark Clapper's criminal past, I found that he's done the wrong things over and over again since he was 12 years old. Mark Clapper has been arrested more than half a dozen times for crimes against children. He likes little boys between four and six, according to court records. When he was arrested this weekend, the arresting officer says he took the urinal next to a four-year-old child at a Westside Target store in an effort to view the child's genitals. Prosecutors say his plan was to sexually gratify himself. We found 36-year-old Clapper's been molesting children for more than two decades. According to court records obtained by Local 12, Clapper's first victim was lured into a shed in 1990 when Clapper was just 12 years old. That information came out in trial in 1997 when Clapper was 19. He pled guilty to gross sexual imposition on a boy under the age of five. The incident took place at Clapper's grandparents' house. Prosecutors at the time said he lured the child into the home with promises of looking at cars and motorcycles. In the 1997 case, Clapper was sentenced to five years on community control because of his age. Six months later, in June of 1998, Mark Clapper was arrested in Sandusky, Ohio on two counts of voyeurism after incidents involving young boys in the shower area of a campground. That resulted in a probation violation which sent Mark Clapper to jail and earned him the title of sexual predator. The judge at that point asked Clapper if he had any idea why he did things like this to children, and he answered no. After serving six months of that sentence, the serial molester was released to his mother and put on probation. In September of 2005, police in Cleves again charged Clapper with gross sexual imposition on another child. That's when this video was shot. While serving another five-year term, yet another child came forward and in 2006, Clapper was charged with molesting that little boy between June and December of 1996. Sent back to prison, he was released in October of 2010 and again placed on parole. When Mark Clapper was arrested this time, it appears his mother once again bailed him out of custody. And because court officials weren't aware of his past history, his bond was set at just $1,500, of which his mom only had to pay $150. Turns out, though, that his current arrest violated his parole status, and adult parole authorities slapped what's called a holder on him. His bond was then raised to a very real $100,000. You know, I I've been trying to count them. There are, are so many. I think there are eight children that this man has been charged with molesting in one way or Eight another. Eight that we know about. Uh, There's a very real possibility that there are even more kids out there. And he's back in court tomorrow, you say? He is. All right, thanks very much.